<laughs> Today we're going to help you to decide if a trip to the movies should be part of your weekend plans. Ryan J reviews. I'm actually headed to a drive-in movie. I think yeah? this weekend in Fort Atkinson. Awesome. Oh. Yeah, with the kids to see Monsters University. Take me with you. That okay. is awesome. Come on. Yeah. I don't know. Okay, Ryan J is a nationally syndicated radio film critic and he's chief correspondent here on the Morning Blend for our movie reviews. So it makes sense that he's taking a look today at White House Down and he'll also share his opinions about the heat both opening this weekend. Yes. We need some heat. Yes. We do, and we need this kind of heat. You know, they say laughter is the best medicine. Uh huh. And I walked out of the heat laughing so hard, having so much fun, feeling elated because it's fantastic. Oh, oh that's awesome. I didn't realize it was a comedy. I guess I haven't seen anything about this one. It's What's rated it R, right? It is, it is. Okay. But I saw this with a movie club, and there were, uh, you know, the whole crew showed up. We had about 20 guests there, people that entered to win. But I have to give a special shout out to Susie Lavender and Kathleen Jenks Grobin right there hi, because ladies. they are oh, so hi, supportive. And they are wearing their Ryan J Movie Club pride right there. They're the best. They're at every movie club, aren't they? They come to several whenever they, you know, I have to be diligent and yeah. fair and not you know you can't win every one but as often as possible you know they're, they're just very supportive and I've wonderful. met them they yes. love your yeah. movie club and they are so supportive it's sweet thanks so much for, yeah. for supporting the that. morning blend too they're so, good in those shirts yeah, I want one thanks they're available on my website all right oh they are <laughs> yes. you know, wear it out all weekend uh, I can't believe as well you, you should give me that for my birthday right right I know yeah. well, maybe I'm working on a hoodie for you <laughs> Because so. she's got street I'm cred, still, I'm you know? leaving it right now. <laughs> yeah. But the heat, the heat is great. It's the same director as Bridesmaids. It stars oh. Melissa McCarthy, who was Oscar nominated for Bridesmaids, and she teams up here with Sandra Bullock. And this movie is magic. It is stunningly hilarious. No really? way. Yes. Okay. See, uh, Identity that. Thief. I, I know you thought was kind of a little mm, bit of a yeah. miss, but my brother just saw that on an airplane. Thought it was hilarious. He just absolutely adores her. She is brilliant, and yeah. she is really doing something original for women in comedy right yeah, now. Yeah, she is. This movie is very rated R. It's very profane, but I loved it. And I feel like you laugh so loud and so much throughout this movie that you actually miss some of it because the audience is literally roaring with laughter. So you miss a couple of the following lines. I want to go back and see it again just to hear everything that's said, but also because there's so many quotable moments. I want to learn some of these lines so when we're hanging out sometime, yeah. we can be like sharing them at brunch and laughing about them. It's a brilliant film. Love it. And the girls are great. I think girl comedians right now are taking over. They really are. I mean, they're sort of coming into their own, and I love that they can open a movie. I mean, Bridesmaids was huge yep. as an ensemble piece. In this film, these two stars really carry the full movie. Melissa's hilarious. I think she ad-libbed a lot of the movie. Sandy also has some great comedic shining moments, and they're brilliant. Sandra Bullock also, by the way, looks like she's 30 years old. She does. But, you know, amazing. Looks like she didn't have any work done, so mm -hmm. incredible. Yeah. That's cool. Okay, so this is definitely a see it, but do you recommend in, on the big screen, or is it almost better to take home so that you can hear everything or replay it? Well, I think it's worth both. I mean, I want to give it the box office. Office. There are no regrets seeing it on the big screen or okay. with a bunch of friends. It's worth it. It's just a fantastic comedy. One of my favorites in like 10 years. All right, I'm okay. going this weekend. And, and then you'll probably want to own it too. It's that good. All right, awesome. we're going to go and everyone will find Molly by her laugh. Okay. <laughs> White House Down, PG 13. Is that for yes, real? Yes, this one's PG 13. It's been compared a lot recently because in March, Olympus Has Fallen yeah. came out and you liked that one too. I it did. has similar plot points. This one's even better. It is PG 13. Channing Tatum, Jamie Foxx, Joey King, James Woods, Maggie Gyllenhaal. It's a great cast. And it's very suspenseful and intense. I jumped a lot during the action of this movie because it's so okay. awesome. It's just a really th fun, thrilling experience. I okay. love Maggie Gyllenhaal. She's so great. She's very yeah. sincere, and she sort of has puppy dog eyes. Kind of girl next door looking. Totally. Yeah. She's real approachable, and she's great in this movie. Hmm. What about Jamie Foxx? You know, I like him. He's a little less annoying in this movie than he has been in some others. <laughs> but the problem with this film is they go for comedy once in a while when the suspense is at its greatest. And it's often oh. Jamie Foxx. And the comedy fails in this movie. It yeah. actually tur turns out being very cheesy and awkward. And because of that, I don't like the comedy aspects, but it doesn't ruin the film. It's still absolutely worth seeing on the big screen. Okay. How probable is the plot? Not very. It's kind of far-fetched. But if you can kind of forgive all the cheesiness in the comedy, and allow yourself to suspend your disbelief like I did in seeing this film, you'll love it, and it's a lot of fun on the big screen. Okay, so good action, good to see in the theater. Mm -hmm. I think these kind of movies, especially if they're in action, they're always better on a big screen. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Is this a see it then, Ryan? This is, yes, both, it's two for two this week. That's good. Yes, it's a good Positive. All right, you're in right, a good that. mood. Um, and you want to say, so you have a special announcement, right? Oh, yes, there's a special movie that's going to be coming to town for two days only on uh, in Milwaukee on July 6th and 7th. It's called My Little Pony Equestria Girls. Mm. And if you go to my website, there's going to be a link to the trailer for the, uh, the official website where you can also see location.
locations in town and buy tickets. And there's also um, a, a way that you can learn how to in, enter to win a special prize pack on my website because I'm going to be giving away two free passes, a My Little Pony DVD set, drawing book, picture book, and a My Little Pony <gasps> figure. Whoa, you're going to make some little girl I, very happy. When I was scared when I was a kid, I sang the My Little Pony song, but all I knew was My Little Pony, My Little Pony. Keep and going. that's it. That's all I knew. <laughs> so I would just loop that over Excellent. and over, and then I was never scared anymore. That's so the if you got part. little kids, Aww. it's a good one for them to see, probably. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. so it looks really fun. People should go to your website then to enter for that. Yeah, you can okay. enter to win the prize pack, mm -hmm. but you'll also find the link to the official site of the movie where you can watch the trailer and buy tickets for July 6th or 7th. All right, and that's awesome. RyanJReviews.com. You can like them on Facebook, follow them on Twitter, and for those full reviews, it's on the website we just mentioned. Thanks, Ryan. Thanks, guys. Great love to it. see you. Two for two today. I love that. Yeah.